In this video I'm going to show you how to open a Calica Vision without having to remove the sticker from the front of it. There's three screws underneath this sticker which hold this whole front panel on but you can get these things apart without removing that sticker and taking the screws out. So there's eight screws on the bottom of the Calica Vision which you need to take out. Three up each side and one here and one here. So you need to take those out first. With the eight screws removed you need to separate the bottom from the top. So this is the front of the Calica Vision here. So this front panel is attached to the top of the system so you need to remove the bottom part. So you need to lift it up from the back, separate the two halves of the case. You will need to take care here, as you, if you pull up too hard you will break some plastic. But if you can see there, this bottom part is tucked in underneath the front panel. And if you gently work it, you can separate the two halves of the case. So if you can do that on both sides, gently work the two halves of the case apart. You will need to pull out on the front part of the case to allow that lip to slip out, if you can see that there. Just gently work your way along. So if you can see this small lip actually tucks under the front panel so what I'm doing is gently lifting this up getting that lip up above the front panel and then just gently work it from both sides so it does take a bit of work just take your time and once you get that lip out from behind the front panel you will get this apart so the actual motherboard inside is attached to the bottom of the case so once you have the two halves loose you basically want to flip it flip it back over and remove the top half of the case just like so so if you wondered what the rattling was there it's a power button it just slips over the top of the switch like that and our reset button and the power supply jack just floats about there there's the reset button there it just sits like that too there's nothing but the top of the case that holds them in to put this back together again, once you have finished working on it, uh, you need to make sure your buttons are set in place and roughly drop the top half of the case down. Get it down as far as you can and then you need to flip it over again. Then you'll need to work this lip back in underneath the front panel which is easier done than getting it out so if you uh, separate the two halves of the case at the back gently lift the bottom the front just snaps right in so just bear in mind when you're doing this that this plastic is close to 40 years old these things were released in 1982 uh, this plastic could be brittle. I haven't had any problems myself doing this. It seems to come apart quite easily. Just don't force anything. Take your time, be patient, and you can take it apart and put it back together again without removing the sticker.